Hey, what's going on, everybody? I hope everyone's doing good. Um, uh, what, what we're going to talk about today, uh, we're going to talk about Metal Fever and we're going to talk about Galvanized Steel. Um, so let's start off with Metal Fever. What is Metal Fever? When you breathe in certain types of fumes from certain metals, it gives you, it can make you sick, very sick. It, it can actually kill you. Um, you can experience flu-like symptoms. You can get the shakes. You can get a fever, you, vomiting, stomach pain. And if you breathe in enough of these fumes of these certain types of metal, it can kill you. So um, what are one of the metals that you definitely, or what are one of the metals that you want to uh, wear a respirator when you're welding? And to be honest with you, you should be wearing a respirator whenever you're welding any type of metal. Um, even if it's even if it's not galvanized steel, you should still be wearing a respirator because you don't want to be breathing in these fumes for 20 plus years. And then the next thing you know, you got black lung and you got lung cancer and uh, you're going and then, you know, you're dying. So it's just something to keep in mind. But galvanized steel, galvanized steel is one of those metals where you must wear a respirator when you're welding. Some people some people will tell you, oh, just hold your breath. But. If you're doing production welding where you're welding piece after piece 10 to 12 hours a day, you can't hold your breath long enough and it's not comfortable holding your breath. The best thing to do is to get a respirator. So galvanized steel, why can't you weld or why should you, what is it in, what is in galvanized steel that can cause metal fever? Well, galvanized steel has zinc chloride in it, which if you breathe enough of that in, it can give you the metal fever, give you the symptoms that I earlier discussed. Um, galvanized steel, it's its uh, very unique. You can't miss it. Um, a lot of bolts are made out of galvanized steel. They have galvanized steel, sheet metal, things like that. Galvanized steel, it has, uh, the best way I can explain it, it's... Um, it looks almost like it's silver. You ever see those bolts at Lowe's and it's like very like metallic silver light. Uh, nine out of ten, that's galvanized steel. And um, galvanized steel has a very unique property to it. When you weld it, it, it turns, or excuse me, when you weld it, it uh, produces this green and white crust on it. This green and white flakes. Uh, that's the best way I can explain it on it. So it's it's very unique. So you you will know if you're welding galvanized steel. So, um, those are, that's just one of those things you definitely need to know because, um, I've heard stories of people, I've known people who've gotten, um, metal fever and it's not pretty and it's not good and it can kill you. So, uh, just keep that in mind and I hope everyone has a good day. Once again, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to, uh, comment, feel free to message me, um, if you are new to uh, my channel or if you're new to my Instagram pra uh, Insta Instagram page, uh, I welcome you and I thank you. And I ask you to follow me and uh, comment below your likes, your dislikes about the page. Um, any tips you may have because I'm learning as well. So everyone have a good day and thank you.